Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Hope you're all doing well. I'm doing quite well myself. Today we're going to be playing Card Life, which is a super cute, adorable survival game. Kind of like Minecraft, kind of like Staxel, those, that kind of genre. And basically what makes this game unique is everything in the world is made out of cardboard. The dirt, the sky, the moon, even your character is all made out of cardboard. And what you can do is you can actually customize things. So like your character, your tools, anything like that you can actually customize yourself. And it's super, super cool. As you guys know, I'm like a DIY person. I love like uh, creativeness like that. When I was small, uh, all of my ties actually got burned uh, in an, like an accident. So I actually uh, for ages had no ties. So I used to draw out characters or cut out pictures of my favorite like things. And I'd like just make like little stories with them. So I thought this game was completely up my alley. Alright guys, so here we are in the character customize. So at the moment you can draw out your character. This is what a character currently looks like, this guy here. He's super cute, super adorable. Uh, so if you want to follow their design, all you got to do is follow their little cutout lines here and you'll get the exact same character. Or you can actually open up your folders, you can search for different characters, designs. So it's kind of all laid out in certain ways that you can customize your character however you like. So, for example, if you wanted your character to look kind of like Clefairy, we could do like that. And come up, have big ears, and it kind of looks like that, like kind of like a Pikachu Clefairy. So we'll cut that out there, actually sorry, we'll get rid of all of this. Or, if you wanted your character to have like a flower design, the whole way around. They kind of have a flower design and you can do like a cutout so that it looks like they're kind of like the sun <laughs> you know that kind of way i think it's just really really cute so for example right now what i want to do is i want to make the i want to make my character kind of like anime-esque kind of like a fairy kind of a thing so for that we're gonna have to take these little dots and bring them down the ears again and straight on just come down and that's our head shape at the moment. Now you're anyway, thinking, Del, that looks kind of cute, but how could you do some like different things here? So for that, what you would do is basically you would just cut out different designs of where you would like your kind of patterns to go. So for example, you'd kind of just do it like this if you wanted your character to kind of you can only kind of cut in where like you can't go too thin with the cardboard so it does it is like a little finicky but honestly that's okay so then just come back up and then you do like, like that so that would be kind of like our hair outline so you could have a hair outline like that if you wanted to now obviously you'll see the back of the the skull if you do that so i don't like doing that what i like doing is i like just doing the kind of like kind of like a pattern up the top so that like it does look kind of like kind of a crown and then we can come around like this and kind of do this so basically what happens is we kind of have like this weird kind of line that comes across there you go like kind of like that so it kind of does look like hair like that and then we can get rid of this there we go and then we'll bring this down here perfect then we can do the eyes so for example the eyes I would like them to have like anime-esque eyes. So for that, I would do stuff like that. Come down. There we go. And then we do like circles for the actual eyes. There we go. And then maybe give it a nose. So we'll do like a little, like that. <laughs> Doesn't it look so cute? And then we can do like a, look at that face, <laughs> isn't that so silly? Then we can do like little like patterns. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Oh no, that got rid of everything. That got rid of everything. Okay, so if you wanted to like say like do like a better picture, you could just do like big circles. Uh, we could do big circles like here. There we go. Do like little mini circles over here for the cheeks. Give it like a little bit of a smile. And then we'll just give it some eyebrows. 
as you can see, it is really, really cute. I really think that this game has like a lot to offer. Oh God, that was like not what I wanted to do. No, 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 no. There we go. There we go. So it's kind of like eyebrows. And then we, we just like, you can keep doing it over and over and over again. And it actually looks so adorable. So for example, if you wanted to like make your character a bunny rabbit. Why did that not go? You can do it up like this. Like that. That's not a bunny rabbit. Let's do a proper bunny. And then we'd have like, like that. Then you could do... Let's do this. You could do the eyes. And then you could do like a big circle for like a shocked face if you wanted to. See? Isn't it just so cute that you could do like the ears and they'd have like the big holes. And basically your character kind of becomes whatever it is you want your character to become. So I'm going to design a little bit of my character and I will be right back. So this is the character that I went with. It's really, really cute. Um, it's kind of like kind of basically a virtual boy. I just wanted to kind of ex just show you the detail that you can get with the faces and stuff like that. I just thought it was really, really cool the way you can get like you can do intricate designs if you're really just patient with it. You know what I mean? So this is the world that we're in and everything is made of cardboard and there's a whole map for you guys to uh, to live in. So basically what we have to do is there's a tutorial and the tutorial just kind of tells you what you need to know. Uh, you can run, you can do things, but I'm just going to gather some stuff up here just for now, just to make sure that we're just, you know, we have food and stuff. And I'm trying to keep an eye out for monsters because monsters are, are not that good. But look at this. You actually punch holes in the cardboard. Isn't that so cute? The cardboard eventually gets like wore down, so you can make like um, like axes and swords and every single thing that you make, you can actually design. So I'll show you guys how to do that. So let's just get rid of this tree and watch this fall over. Watch it fall over. Isn't that so cute? So it pops into wood that you can then collect. So there we go. So craft a wooden hatchet. So press I for inventory. Uh, let's make sure that we're not near any enemies. I for inventory. And these are all the weapons that you can make. Isn't this insane? There is so much here. You can even make like a little statue, which is a decoy. You can make like a wooden landscape. Like you can make all of these beautiful little pictures and stuff here. So right now it wants us to make a hatchet, which is this one here. So we just need to get some fiber. So we actually need to get some fiber. So let's go ahead and do that. I think fiber we'd get from these things as far as I know. So let's come over and grab some of that. Thank you. Let's grab some of you. I think you press like F8, isn't it, to see your character? There we go. See us? Look at us. Look at us walking around. There we go. Let's grab some of this. Okay, I think we got enough fiber now. I don't know why it's nighttime. I wish. I wish you. I really wish it wasn't nighttime. So I let's craft the hatchet, and then it comes up like this. So now you can actually design your hatchet, which is really cool. So I kind of want to design like a mega extra hatchet, if you guys uh, don't mind. So I think we'll do like pincing materials here. So that's how it gets down. And then we'll just do like a really cute little spiral. Okay. And then I kind of want it to just come in really slimsy. And then have like a nice little spiral in like this. Have another little spiral over here. Because if you're going to cut stuff out of cardboard, you might as well like use the cardboard to a fullest. And then we'll do that. Then we'll bring this up here like that. Like that. And then we'll do the same spirals on this side, which is kind of cute. There we go. There, look how extra our thing looks already. I think it does look kind of funny looking. So what we would do then is we would just like, we could like put our name in here, we could put anything. But I'm just gonna put like a little love heart for now. There we go. And you could also design the um, the thing that you hold. So for that, I think I'm gonna do like kind of like a viney shape. So I'm gonna do like, like that. Just so it is kind of a viney kind of a shape. There we go, so that's kinda like that. And then we can do a pattern. So I think the pattern will be little love hearts that we can just pop in every now and again. 
There we go. Isn't that, doesn't that look kind of cute? And then obviously we can take this out here, put a little pattern in there, and then create. So now we have a lovely little thing, and if we carry it, we can see it in our hand. So it says, eat a springberry to reduce hunger, and I think they're over here. So I think we actually have to use our hands for that. Let's go ahead and grab you guys. Thank you. Eat a springberry. Uh, there we go. So let's see. You are stuffed, you can't eat anymore. Okay, so we kind of just need to like run around, get hungry. Ba -da -bum, ba -da -bum. Let's get so hungry. Let's just run around and make ourselves some food. Did something? I don't think anything saw us. Ooh. This is like a sand dune. That's kind of cool. I haven't been hungry just yet. So I think maybe we just, we'll just... Let's just keep going. So let's uh, cut down these trees. Look at that. Look at our axe work away. Axe is working up the magic. And obviously then you can like... You can dig stuff down if you want to, like, you know, just dig it lower. It's like, if you wanted, you could leave it like that, you know? Like, maybe you have some designs in, in mind. Maybe you want to, like, cut down the trees and have, like, something like... I mean, it would work. Have the tree fall over. Perfect. Grab all these pieces of wood. And you can make a lot of different stuff. It's really, really cool. I really like it. Come over here, you can make even armor, for example, you can make like wooden like legs. So this is be like your wooden legs. You can make even like, if you wanted to make like high heels, you could. And just have like... Like, do you know what I mean? <laughs> you can make whatever it is you actually wanted to make with this. Like you could make a whole, like, there we go. And we can pop those onto us if we wanted to. So they go up there. Then if we press F8, you can see if I can get up, actually. I don't know if you can see it, but we're actually wearing the um, we're, we're wearing the, the high heels. So we're just taking on the world wearing high heels, which I think is kind of cool. I, 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 I don't know. This game is a lot of customization, which I think you guys will like. So I just wanted to do like a really cute little short video on it, on the character customization, just to highlight that there is games out here that kind of let you kind of like freely explore and freely like do things. It's a multiplayer game, so you guys can have a lot of fun. You can build like a lot of houses. I'm not going to do like a whole survival series in this because I'm pretty sure like you guys will like want to do that and you guys know the gist of like survival kind of games. But the fact is everything is made of cardboard. So it's everything is literally that you can make you can design. So anything in here that you can do, you can design yourself. For example, there's like, um, there's um, kind of like armored leggings. There's even like an enchantment table that you can make. There's a furnace you can make and you can design all of them piece by piece to the way like you kind of want to have them look. So you can even do like the decoys, which we can do. So let's get, let's get some sturdy oak wood for, to make a decoy. So let's do that, let's craft that. So there we go. We can make our own little character. So let's make him, Let's make him like this. Let's just make him like all over the place. Like he's going to be like, he's going to look like a really weird character. Oh, I think we have to go around the whole side. So we can come down here. We can make him like a tentacle monster. Have like another tentacle. Have another tentacle. Another tentacle. Another tentacle. Tentacles are here. Tentacles are here. And then tentacles here. There we go. Isn't that kind of cool? Like you can make your own little statues and then you can place it in the world. But yeah, that's going to be it for me today, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in and watching. I hope you guys check out Card Life. It's super, super cute. This video also wasn't sponsored, in case you guys are thinking that. I just really like the game, and I really like the creative customization, and I wanted to show the devs some love. So uh, yeah, love you guys so much. Have a great day. Follow me on all social media, and bye-bye.